Well, happy sunshine family. Somebody posted a link in the comment section to this article. We're looking at NBC WBIR and this is coming out of Knoxville. Uh, how about that? It's 66 degrees. I mean, uh, they got this encoding go going already? Wow. So this is the first mainstream news article mentioning this case that I have seen. I just point out here that they in the very first sentence a woman who authorities say you know I was talking about the well that really doesn't highlight that well on this background we've talked about how propaganda is inserted as news as reality through the mainstream media a really good documentary for you guys to find and watch is called outfoxed and this is what they do they they give some real vague general group of people a woman who authorities say who who's the name that is saying this so what they're doing is they are connecting in this first sentence the idea of Heather Ann Tucci Giraffe and the idea of the sovereign movement. They're already declaring her sovereign in, in the mainstream media. And then they talk about the federal indictment and that she was working with a man in a scam to get hundreds of thousand dollars from the US Federal Reserve. They're, they just say some facts about uh, their full names, their ages, and that it's in US District Court in Knoxville. They've been indicted on five counts, or Randy's been indicted on five counts, Heather's been indicted on one count. And then they cite very interestingly, the article in the Southern Poverty Law Center that I previously referenced in a video as, hey, this is the start of the smear campaign. So look, in the very first mainstream news article, Southern Poverty Law Center is being used as uh, a place of support for why they're writing this article. Tucci Giraffe, identified as having a Washington state address, has attracted numerous follows, followers, some internationally, through a group called One People's Public Trust that argued against recognition of any traditional government and was mistrustful of the banking system, according to the Southern Poverty Law Center. So again, oh wow, anybody that goes and searches for Heather and Tucci Giraffe and Southern Poverty Law Center, uh, they, they're just going to lead them right into a whole smear campaign. So I'll let you read the, the rest of this article, but I just really wanted to get on now and do this video and show that while they're saying it's 66 degrees in Knoxville, it looks like the Gematria encoding on this page is is there and I'm gonna forward this to Derek at Gematronator 64 and we'll see what he has to say all right keep the pertinent links love and light coming and we'll be back soon